So today my special guest is, what's your name? Anita. Anita, she's my seven year old daughter, she's turning eight in July, she's going to grade, what grade are you going to? Two. Grade two um, this year. Um, the school starts the 13th of January, they had a very long holiday, summer break. It was from the 20th of November until the 13th of January when it starts. Um, I'm going to show you all her stuff that she needs for school, her school supplies, and I'm also going to show you a uniform that she, she's going to wear. Um, I just want to make it clear that in South Africa, the kids don't wear casual clothes, they wear the uniforms. So I'm going to show you that in a bit. But first, let's get going on this uh, school supplies. Okay. I've got my list on my phone. So, uh, the list on my phone. Okay. So, the first thing she's going to need is six uh, pencils. Uh, Grey pencils. This side. You can show it to the camera, please. Uh, yeah, it's just normal six HB pencils. Um, that they use for school. Okay, the next thing they're going to use is waterline books, the thick one, two of them. I still need to put some clothes on this, on the books. Okay, so it's two of those. Then it is uh, one, um, one rubber for, yeah, one rubber and then what else a coloring a book a coloring book a normal coloring book no with no activities in it you get the coloring books that got activities in it but this one it mustn't have it must only have pictures inside no activities that the kids must do so uh, one thick one uh, then uh, crayons, the thin one, and it's the the one that you turn out. Um, it's this one. You can show. It. Yeah, that's the front right. Yeah, it's this one. Um, you turn it out. Let me just get quickly get one. Let me just show you more or less. It's these crayons that you take and you turn it out like that. The crayons, like a pen normally. Okay. Then the next thing they use is the thick crayons, the bigger ones, it's those ones, it's the thick one. I'm going to show you an example of those ones, just need to get it, okay, it's the thick, thick, thick ones, okay, okay, then it is a sharpener with two sides, one for thick, one for thin, it's just a normal, you can just put it like this, it's a normal one, just like that, okay, then you're going to need two glue sticks, and she, it's the print mark, and the thick, it's the thick one, and she's also going to need the clear boss stick, it's like clear glue that you use for uh, tasks and stuff like that uh, for arts and crafts but we didn't get it yet we are still waiting her father bought all this for her okay the next one is two rulers 30 centimeters each two of them one for class and i think the other one is for um for arts and crafts one flip file with 30 bags, it's just a normal flip file with some plastic bags inside that they're going to put their homework and stuff in. Then uh, a ring uh, file, a ring file, it looks like this and with the rings, let me just turn it around, um, with the rings on here, they, they're going to put their task in, inside of this, this file. Okay. Mm. Then four plastic uh, envelopes that with a knip. They're gonna use it for every 
every semester, they've got four semesters, and they just put their classwork and all those stuff in here. Okay, there's four of those. Then, coloring pencils, pencils, yeah, coloring pencils, 12 of them, you just buy it like this. But they said they, they need a, a good, good quality. I'm not sure about this quality, but okay, it has to do. Um, then scissors that they can use for the art and crafts and all those paper that they have to cut. So scissors. Okay, two holders of tissues. We don't have the tissue set, we're still waiting for it. Her father is buying them, so we're still waiting for that. Okay, uh, then two empty cans. We only got one so far, a veg with ve from veg and fruits uh, cans. Just as normal cans that you buy with your food inside, then you're just going to, they're going to need it. I don't know what for, but they need it. Okay. The next one is uh, a tennis ball for activities just a normal tennis ball just don't show your name I've got the we've got the dandelion club for her okay so that's the tennis ball then a uh, skipping rope this one I have to say it was last year's skipping rope the it there's nothing wrong with it she's going to use it again this year last year she needed it they didn't use it so we're going to send that one again Okay, then lastly, but not least, is pastel, pastels, um, all the arts and craft people and everybody that do arts and crafts know exactly what this is, um, it's pastels, I'm going to show you, you paint like normal paint, let me just show you that, okay, and then lastly is uh, water paint, water paint, it's just normal water paint let me just show them it's just normal paint with a brush and stuff like that so that is it <laughs> they didn't call for um for a, a, a space case we call it a space case uh pen black in afrikaans um yeah they didn't call for it but this one was last year's there's nothing absolutely nothing wrong with it it's still fine She's going to use it again this year. They didn't ask for pencil cases, but I know um, at our school, the children like to steal, at my daughter's school, the children like to steal her stuff and steal everybody's stuff. So I'm giving this for her for safekeeping so that she can put all her pencils and crayons and stuff like in here. Um, I have to give another space case as well for the other thicker crayons, but that's it. And then it's just her suitcase. A backpack, just a normal backpack. She used it last year. She uses it this year. She's gonna use it again because there's still nothing wrong. I'm not one of we are not one of those parents that buy our kids every year a new school bag, new school bag. New. No, if it's fine, she can use it again. Why waste money on stuff that isn't necessary? Because in the long run, if this in the middle of the year. Maybe those crowns are broken, some of them, then we have to buy again. So why we can use those money that we use for the backpacks, we can use for those stuff. So yeah, now I'm going to quickly show you her in a uniform and yeah, and then that will be that. So I'm going to quickly show you that in her Okay everybody, so this is a school uniform. It's just a green uniform with green socks and black shoes. You can turn around, Anita. You can come closer, a little bit closer to the camera. Yeah, so that's her uniform. She's also got a winter uniform, but we're not going to show that because it's not winter here in South Africa. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Have a great one. Bye.